Welcome back to the final, just kidding, it's not the final episode, if you thought that, you're dumb. So, I figured, let's fight the final boss, well, in quotes, final boss of Yokai Watch. So, this guy is, um, welp, he's Nightmare Fuel. Um, the only reason I've kind of made him, not, I've considered him not as scary as a spider is solely to the fact that I've kind of, I've fought this guy before. Just look, the ground is dead. Everything is white, dead. And you know what he's doing? He's just casually sitting there, just waiting for us. Hey friend, how you doing, buddy? So, you made some new seals. Big whoop. You think that'll stop me? The aura that swims through here is all mine, just like your world. Your seals are nothing, you hear me? Nothing! Let's just stand there real quick. Yeah, what's up? Watch, watch him laugh. Now he's Nightmare. <laughs> Time for me to teach you what real power is. Let's see what you got. Bottom line is you're not taking over anything. That's right. Why, well, you may as well just give up and go home right now. Nobody wants you here anyway. You're kind of agreeing with humans against me. I'm incredulous. I'll make you a deal. Join me and you can rule this world. How's that? A, you can't bargain with something you don't have. B, you can't bargain with something I have no interest in. You really are quite an awful negotiator, you know that? And this man's supposed to be chairman. This is, this boss right here, this guy right here, he's supposed to be the chairman. Okay. See, we are, uh, we are actively choosing to live and coexist with humans. Yeah, I'm not gonna let a bully like you threaten Amy's realm. I'll protect Amy and Coleman no matter what the cost. You got like some sort of like... Different lisp kind of thing, Juanyan. Just saying, buddy. Uh, yeah, it's bad to do that. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, well said. You've all lost your pride. You let yourselves be tamed like little pets. I have nothing more to discuss with you. This world is mine. Now you shall feel the power that will rule both worlds and your souls. Prepare yourselves. This will be all the more satisfying if you put up a fight. Hi there, friend. <laughs> Listen, okay, no, I can't say listen to music, because literally, I will be blasted to death by copyright from level 5. And that's also the reason why I'm not just gonna stop talking, okay? But this man is, he's unique. So basically, you attack both of his tentacles, correct? That are sticking out of his nose. <laughs> I, I can't even. This thing is just really creepy. It's just, uh, I don't even know. I feel like I'm gonna be ranting about that for a while in this um, battle. But basically, once you take this out, he's completely vulnerable, and his second mouth opens up. No joke. He also heals your stasis. Once you get both of those in, he'll eventually open up his little, its little second mouth. Look at this. Ready? Open it up already. You're making me look like an idiot. There we go. Look at this. Whoa. Whoa, Golden Wisp. I see you. Triple XV2. Wow. So... My main problem with this fight is due to the fact that he constantly, and I mean constantly, in spirit cheer yokai. Which would work well for most people, you know, they're like, oh, I have the reflexes to do this, you know, it won't be that bad. I have to do YouTube. You know how hard that is, not to have my fingers on the screen? But I'll try. So, um, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll try, I guess. I'm gonna try to um, purify. So sorry if you hear any awkward, you know... Noises. <laughs> that sounds so bad. But yes, also, um, Slippery Yokai are pretty good to dodge these, I'm not gonna lie. But sorry if you see my pencil on the screen or anything along the lines of that. Trust me, I'm, I'm struggling to, you know, purify my Yokai right now as it is. Okay, the pop ones I can actually do. I, I'm pretty good at those. There we go. So I can throw you guys back up here. But yes, you will need to constantly, and I mean constantly, purify your Yokai in this fight. And that's about all I can say, really. Is that this guy is just a true nightmare, and he constantly, um, spirits your team. And that's extremely, like, irritating, but, you know. Something you have to deal with. This man is just, he's here. He's Chairman McCracken. Sorry you heard my pencil there. Bit weird, I know. You gonna dodge that off? Yeah, shout out an ox dodging like a beast. Or something like that. that. <laughs> So, once he hits around half health, he actually starts using some stronger attacks, such as Your Calamari. Wish I could make stuff like this up. No joke, it's called Your Calamari. And he tries to literally kill you, and by grilling you to death. 
because the grueling metal yokai works really well. Now this in spirit here, we're just lower defense. I honestly don't care about that. I have two Robon Yans, a Golden Yan, over level defense tough bonus. I'm, I don't care how he's going to hit me. But once I get dizzy, that's a different story. I then care. I proceed to actually care. Bitch saw my pencil there, didn't ya? But that's okay. I'm sorry you can't hear just the glorious music. Well, you can probably hear it vaguely over my annoying voice. But, hey. It's really, it's really well done. It really fits into the theme. Reminds me of really amazing, um, people that make music such as, like, in the Mario and Luigi series. Very good tracks that they make. Gee, shut up, I'm not dodging like a god. Or Hellfires, I call that. Very good names there. Still dodging. Whoa. Don't do that. Smacking yourself in the face. <laughs> okay. So, um, will I be doing all the Nightmare Fuel enemies? Oh, here's his half health, by the way. Starts laughing again. Crackhead. But yeah, um, will I be doing all the, um, the demon bosses in the Infinite Inferno? Yes, I will. I am proceeding to, I'm gonna proceed to do that right after this, one, actually. Right after this, um, I'm gonna go ahead and, and get the Infinite Inferno open, might do a tutorial on it, because I know some people actually are like, wow, how do I get in here? And they have to look it up on GameFAQs or whatever websites you people use. <laughs> I honestly don't really use stuff like that. I actually found out how to do it myself. The only thing I had to ask was how to get this one yokai, which um, I found on Reddit. Everything else I basically found myself. Maybe a YouTube video. I think I got a YouTube video get the help when you get all evil, which I will be doing a video on as well, but I think that's about it, really. Everything else I discovered myself. And I actually played through the game with a really, really decent team, actually. I was here, I had like a de level 44, like, Darren Macho and stuff. I think I had the Komasan Komajiro combo still up. I needed to evolve them, that's how much I love them. At the time, I mean, my feelings have changed now. My favorite yokai is, indeed, of this game, Golden Yen. My favorite Yoko overall is in Yoko Watch 2. There's your Calamari, by the way. Awesome move. But I apologize if you think my voice is annoying. I have to talk, otherwise, um, copyright would literally murder me. You know how Nintendo is. They love copywriting everyone just to get all the money. <laughs> money is fun. Apparently, Nintendo's eyes, at least. Jeez. Okay, these spirits are getting a little bit annoying, really. There's, there's a wind attack. He's already shown his electric attack. Incredible shock. Spider uses that too. Something similar to that. Mr. Turan Tutor. But he's getting on um, low on health, which is good. I will get a load of XP from this fight. All the purifications and stuff. It's it's really good XP. Plus, I got triple XP, Golden Wisp. The bullcrap luck that I typically seem to get. Oh, first time I actually got a heal. Oh my gosh, Coleman actually has to heal. Huh. Well, that's strange. Yeah, my name's Coleman, if you didn't know already. You can look at the old comments in my videos. Here's his god move, Soulmate vibe. Here we go. Posquitable end. This is just hyper death, basically. You know, it's a very cool attack, I guess you could say. Oh my goodness. This uncalibrated touch screen on my old DS. It's so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so bad. Uh, that was hard to do. Oh boy. So, yeah. This is, um, Chairman McCrackhead. I mean, McCracken. Definitely not, you know, a drug abuser. He's he's normal. Look how normal this man is. Look, how, look at him. He's so normal. Soulmate vibe again. You're really fond of that move, aren't you? Possible end. I love how, um, you know, Level 5, they had the audacity to try and promote puns in the final attack of their final boss. This big build-up, and they throw in a pun. That's why I love Level 5. And trust me, their other game, Fantasy Life, they, it wasn't any better. The puns literally would not stop. I loved it. It had that classic charm to it, you know, from the video games I used to play when I was younger, and I, I really like that. I'm getting off topic, aren't I? And I'm just talking about things to stall so I don't get copyrighted. What do you know? This man is almost okay. You are really rude for doing that attack. I don't appreciate you doing this. I've actually done a decent job of hiding up oh, the camera's wobbling. I just noticed this. Oh gosh. 
And I bumped it too. Oh, lovely. Hey, Slayer, can you hit him already, please? Gracias, amigo. I don't speak Spanish. I, although I am taking Spanish too. I, I know it very vaguely at best. Soulmate vibe again. I bumped the camera again. Soulmate vibe. Oh, I cancelled it too. Okay. That's just insult to injury. <laughs> Look at this. His little red ball falls out of his mouth and he just self destructs like everything else. And we won. Eterna just laughs. Th th thanks, jerk. You moron. <laughs> so we win. It's very great. You know, um. <laughs> okay. So, um. Loads of levels here, everybody. 32,000, huh? Wow. So prepare yourselves for long cutscenes, which hopefully don't have music so I don't get copyrighted. Here comes my flawless voice acting. <clears throat> I don't believe it. How can I possibly <laughs> Stop with the puns. How can I possibly lose? What a... <sighs> what a calamity. Stop. Oh, please. Are you quite thorough? <laughs> Let's all experience your demise with a bit of self-respect. The deadness in Whisper's eyes, piercing everyone's heart. As a butler, I'm quite proud of all of us. Our cooperation was stellar, except that I used literally zero of the yokai that are actually here to help win. I don't regret a thing, yow! Still got your list going on, don't you? I feel kind of confident. That's coming, that's a first boy. It's like King Enma always said. The character that we have absolutely, just absolutely zero in, in the law. We don't even know who they look like for this matter. The human world needs our friendship, not our control. To witness a strength of friendship is both inspiring and humbling. Whisper, that's beautiful. Cry. <laughs> Bye. Ooh, fade the white. Ooh, this is this is big stuff. Now this is probably my biggest problem with Yokai Watch next to the befriending system. How the story actually ends off here? It makes no sense really. Slash it, ready? Oh, uh, so let me guess here. This isn't quite over, right? No, not yet. We have one final task. We have to close that yokai elevator. Wait, no! No, I love my Robanyans and Golden Yans. Stop. If we do that, then all of you will disappear too. Ah, go tell on that piano, that nice copyright. Ayy. If that happens, what was the point of fighting McCracken? The yokai world is still in chaos, even though he's gone. Evil yokai wants to harness the chaos and take it to the human world. The only way to stop that is to close that elevator. No, you can't! Every meeting leads to a parting, Coleman. It's the circle of life. Yes. 80% of those lead to literally, literal death. Just death itself, okay? That's not a determined fact by any means. Our goodbyes were fitted since the moment we met at this very tree. <laughs> Gosh, a really deep whisper, jeez. But I'm not ready! I know, you love your Golden Yen and Robanyan, and other very other yokai that I happen to get. By the way, I need to do more videos on rare yokai. I'll do that. It'll be fine. It's time for me to perform my final duty as your butler. Oh, there we go. I love how the game assumes that you have Anoko. Like, literally, when I first played this game, I did not have Anoko. Here we go. Cool. We're now closed for business. Nice pun, bro. Let me get the pun, I don't know. Don't be sad, Nate. Be glad. I need to deal with the nightmare in his Lodo. Jeez. My time as your butler has come to an end. Thank you. We must now go back to Bye, guys. No, don't show Jabanyan. Don't do this. Yo, insult the injury. Vinoch is sitting there like a beast. Bye bye, friend. Vinoch just sits there. Yeah, I know, right? Gone! Bye. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Man actually sounded like he gave a crap there. Uh, gotta talk a little bit so I don't get copyrighted. Um, uh, I bet you're pretty sad, Nate, aren't you? Copyright done, please? No, it's not. Okay. Oh, uh, here comes a depressing walk. Look how sad he is. Jeez. You doing okay, buddy? Oh, there's your, there's your pedals. Um, can you shut up, phone? I'm so sorry. Immediately happy. What is this, man? That's so, uh, that's so, uh, like, unprofessional for me to keep that in. Thank you, Whisper. Thank you too, Nate, for making this really cool game, maybe, possibly, I don't know. My yokai friends. Goodbye, Nate. And that is, that's the end of our walkthrough. I'm kidding. And the walkthrough is done! Now I'm back to my everyday life. That's cool, Nate. Yeah. Now look at this right here. I want you to look at this. Say look at this. Right? Is out of nowhere. The Yokai just return. Hi, Jabanyan. The Yokai just come out just come back. No reason. Just back just nowhere. Just back out of nowhere. No, nothing explained. No, this, this isn't explained at all. Oh gosh. Game thinks. Oh, you have QB, obviously. It's back to normal, all right. Hi, Whisper. Nice mouth. I can't think of anything else to say. So yeah, the end. Yeah. And it literally just it shows you this. Okay. So thank you all for watching this video. There's a reason why I skipped the credits. There is so much copyrighted music, you have no idea, okay? I would literally be dead. But yeah, um, other than that, um, I want to say thank you all for watching. If you leave a like, I will give you 8 million Lamborghinis. Definitely not a scam. Totally not a reference to Leafy or anything. You know, trying to use, you know, clickbait for all the dumb little kids. Um, yeah, click the like button or I'll literally kill you. Bye. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks to Lucas acting as an intermediary, we were able to return.